is going on guys it is july 13th and we are heading over to mountain mud run to do race prep for next weekend well it's pretty early earlier than i normally go but they have a parade going on over there at 11 o'clock so i'm trying to beat that we got the truck all loaded up both bouncers we got a special surprise over there that i'm going to be shooting a video for and we also brought my frankenstein savage it's just a savage with an armadif and savage sandra so hopefully you can film some videos while we're there well i'm gonna get on the road and i will see you guys there for those that are unfamiliar with uh new hampshire or the park if you're ever curious of how far mountain mud run is for me it's about a half an hour away from my house guys for the drivers that are going to be watching if you're wondering which side we're going to this should be your uh, clue we're going over to the mud pit slash the sand pit side hey guys we are over here just got here this is kind of the uh, the layout that I got to work with we used to race in another spot up over there but as you can see from the rest of mountain mud run it is very overgrown so trying to save myself a little work. I used to go out and clear out a spot up there every time. Drivers know, it used to be the first spot that we raced in here. But this is the part where I'm gonna scratch my head for a little bit and uh, try to come up with some different hills. Because, like I said, we have ran this spot quite a few times. And as you see, there's not all that much that I can do. Uh, kind of limited, so. See if I can come up with uh, something a little creative and figure out something different. Well, I think I came up with two hills for over here that are a little bit different than what we've ran before. So instead of trying to explain it to you, I'm just going to throw you on the tripod, throw it in time lapse, and cue the music. We got three hills done so far. I haven't done much filming because it's old home day here in Warren, New Hampshire. If you can hear the sirens in the background, they've been going on for about past 45 minutes. So I have uh, not been doing much filming besides the time lapse. Anyway, we're gonna come over here. I'm gonna throw it in time lapse again so you don't have to hear the stupid sirens. But uh, this is gonna be the last hill. And then hopefully by then, all of the sirens will be uh, done and I can uh, explain what the hills are gonna be. Alrighty guys, race four, deja vu. Well, here's your deja vu. We've been here before. So we came up, well we, by we I mean I, I came up with uh, four hills, plus we're gonna do knockout racing. Uh, knockout racing is probably gonna be where it's all tore up over there because they graded it pretty nice for us once I rake it down race day. But knockout racing will probably be over there. You guys will probably be starting way back here. That way you have all kinds of room to have some fun. Uh, so we're gonna go through first hill. All right, so hill one, Stargate's gonna be somewhere around right here. You're going over this, it's kind of like a spine, so it's your choice to jump it or not. Obviously down into the pit. Up this left side, coming up here. And you're coming up this this is all pretty loose that's still pretty tacky but you're going up the road there's gonna be a finish at the top second hill same start gate so you're going back over the spine and then you have your choice to either go up that side or this side and then straight out the top be a finish somewhere up there third hill a little bit different you're gonna start over here be a start gate somewhere down there. Up this, up this nice manicured side. Hopefully it's a little drier. It's uh, we got a lot of rain here, so 
it's really tacky right now but you're going up that around those rocks up there down this and then you have your choice to go either way or rust you can just jump if you feel like it <laughs> and then up that finish line on the other side and hill four gotta go over here we ran this one before it's a little I don't know it gets pretty steep at the top but be a start gate over here up and over into the pit all the way up and then I'll go up and show you the top there's a little jump at the top all right so here's the top start gates over there all the way up 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 that little jump then up there and yes you do have to stay to the left of the rocks so that's what we're looking at for hills obviously you're gonna want those dig dig tires all right so i'm gonna take a quick break it is freaking hot out and then uh we're gonna run the hills i'm gonna time myself and i'll do like i did before leave you guys on the tripod and not edit a dang thing and you guys will be able to see it and whatever times i get for a baseline is what times i use to set the time limit come race day all right here we go three two one go. So even with me struggling, 28.84, we're going to try the second hill. Hmm, which way do I want to go? And three, two, one, go! Wow, that was really fast. Now I have no clue where my bouncer is. All right, for hill two. 1319. All right, hill three. I'm gonna be coming right at you for the finish line. Hopefully you guys can see over there. But Starcade's gonna be right around there. And up that, through there, down that. Alright, and three, two, one, go! Oh. Alright, here we go. Hill three. 2087 and I was totally driving from the bottom if I was actually driving I'd probably want to be up there so I can see that turnaround point a little more but we're gonna go over to last hill all right I'm gonna try to drive from down here again hopefully you guys can still see you know, I know the drones up there but actually hang on and three two one go further back but I don't feel like going to get it so last hill 1734 guess what the time limit is for all hills one minute all right guys that is going to do it for this one we're going to get some last minute slow-mos to uh, end off the video all the drivers I will see you Saturday all the race fans you have some race footage to look forward to very soon see you on the next one later